What's up guys, got some products to review and give away for you today. Uh, actually, so many that I can't even fit them all on the screen. Uh, but we've got some cases and some screen protectors and uh, headphone holders. And yeah, that's about it. And uh, these were sent to me by iCase.com. I guess that's how you pronounce this. It's spelled I-Q-A-S-E. I-Q-A-S-E, which I'll display on the screen right here. I'll have a link in the description of their site also. You can go check out some of the cases. Uh, they have some great products. I've used a bunch. Of, I've used most of these cases. I'm going to be putting them on my iPhone, showing you what I think about them. Uh, we got some screen protectors and everything to give away. Uh, I'm going to give away all this stuff. I'm actually well, not all of it. I'm going to keep like two cases for myself uh, because I really do like these. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get into this. Show you what I think about them. I'll show you what I like about some of these cases, and uh, see if you guys can find anything you like. So first off, let's look at the headset loop. I guess that's what you call that loop, 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 loop. Uh, but these are pretty cool. As you see, I've got one right here. Uh, basically what it is, it's got these little uh, slots over here on the sides, on both sides. And that's just for the uh, end of the cord. And then you wrap it around it, and then you can put your headphones in each of the holes. So it's basically a uh, thing that you can wrap your headphones around to put them in your pocket. Because I know, especially with these Apple headphones, it does it all the time. When I put these in my pocket without this thing, these things get so tangled up and it's so annoying having to untie them and everything every single time when I listen to music. And I listen to music a lot, uh, so these definitely come in handy. Uh, save me a lot of untangling time. I really, really, really like these. I think these were like three bucks, so that's a great price for uh, this product right here. I really like it. And then we've got these screen protectors. Um, superior screen protection for your Apple iPod Touch. So these are the iPod Touch versions of them. Uh, here is uh, superior screen protection for your Apple iPhone. And this says superior anti-glare screen protection for your Apple iPhone 3G. So we do have some, some stuff for the iPod, uh, for the iPhone first generation, and the iPhone 3G slash 3GS. So let's go ahead and start looking at the cases. And uh, I can put a screen protector on at the end because I do need one actually for myself. Uh, so let's go ahead and look at this case first. This is actually my favorite case out of all of them. Uh, it's basically just a little hard case. Uh, it slides right on there. It gives you access to all the uh, buttons and headphone jacks and camera and everything, just like any other case does. But uh, it's a hard case. I definitely like the color of it, and I like that it's shiny. Uh, it feels good in your hand. It's not too thick. Uh, I don't really like thick cases, uh, but it feels good. And this thing is really sturdy, too. This is not loose but it's it's pretty easy to get off too if you push it in yeah that's that's one thing i don't like about some hard cases is that they're hard to get off well now look okay there we go all right so it slides right off there you set that down and then it just slides right out of here so there you go and it's got uh unlike a lot of hard cases it's got some uh soft material in here so it doesn't scratch your phone up so i really like this case It's definitely the best case that i've used out of all of these i'm not sure the pricing on this but you can check it out at the link in the description so that's what the case looks like very nice. Uh, we also have a red one right here. I am going to keep this case for myself. Blue is my favorite color. I will be giving this one away. It's the same model as this. It's just red. So I didn't feel like having to take that out of the packaging. Uh, you guys see what it looks like. It's just a red color of it. The next case is similar to the case that I just showed you, uh, which is this one. It's basically the same design of case, uh, except on this one, this has more of a matte finish, kind of like, than uh, a shiny finish. So, or a glossy finish, I guess you'd say. I'm going to be technical about it. So it's, it's the same model of case. Uh, slides right in there. It does have the protective stuff on it. Slides right in there. Snug as a bug in a rug. <laughs> so I'm going to pop that right on there. All right, and there we go. And that's what it looks like. Looks just like that one. I actually, I said I like this one the best, but I don't know. Actually, I guess I didn't use this one. I thought these were the same thing when I first looked at them. Uh, but this one has more of a matte finish. And I kind of like this just as a dark blue. Uh, and it looks like it will have less uh, like smudges and stuff as the shiny one would. Uh, this case feels just as good as this one. It's just as thin. Same model and everything as I said. Uh, and comes off the same. And it feels nice. And this case, just like this one, also comes in a red model exactly like it with the matte finish and everything. And again, I do not feel like taking that out of the case because it's basically the same case. You see that. So let's look at this case to the far left. Uh, this case at first actually didn't make any sense to me because I was like, uh, don't really understand why you'd put it in this thing. Uh, but actually after I tried it, which I'll show you in just a minute what how it makes sense, it's pretty cool. So uh, it's got this strap on it which you can strap to your arm and uh, use while you're driving. You can use it while you're playing sports. 
or doing anything. It's actually kind of loose on me. I don't know. Maybe I'm not tightening it up right. You can use this, say you're you're running, uh, you want to play music or listen to music or something, you're busy doing something, anything. There's tons of things you can be doing to use this case and have it strapped to your arm and keep your iPhone where you can just mess with it. And now you're saying, okay, well, you're going to have to take it out anyway. Actually, no, you're not. Let's go ahead and show you what that does. You see it gives you access to the uh, headphone jack and the power button. Now watch this. So as you see, this works through the plastic. It, it feels like any other kind of plastic and it feels like it'll protect it really good. I can't scratch the screen with this thing on it. But we still get access to the screen. It, it, we can type on it. We can do anything. It's pretty cool. I really like this case, especially if you like to run track and stuff like that. Strap it to your arm, turn on some music, and you can still uh, use your screen and everything. So that's a that's a pretty good case. Now this next case uh, is just like the other ones that I showed you before, except it is all uh, black and matte finished. Uh, just like the other ones, it pops out. Put it on your iPhone. It does have the... Uh, protective stuff right there so it won't scratch your phone up and it's just like the other ones this one's also a good case I actually like this one a lot uh, just because it's all black uh, it's pretty pretty nice and I like this because I like the matte finish on it just because it doesn't seem like it like I can't put fingerprints and everything on it like a lot of cases do uh, like the shiny cases they'll they'll leave a few fingerprints uh, but this one's not gonna get any fingerprints left on it so let's take a look at these next three cases uh, this one right here is like a leather sleeve uh, this will just slide right into here. That seems like really durable. Wow, that actually surprised me. I didn't think that would be as strong as it feels. Like it actually, it feels like it'll really, like, like I could just throw my phone off a building and it would survive. Uh, at least I guess if it doesn't hit right here. That, that does feel, that's a, I like this case. I actually hadn't even tried this one. It still gives you access to the uh, USB port so you can charge it. Uh, you got access to the, headphone jacks if you want to listen to music while you're doing it uh... and and even the silent button i really like this case because you don't find too many uh... leather cases that are this thin with the iphone and are this protective i haven't actually came across a case that was like this i really like this because i definitely like how thin it is because you can set it in your pocket but it's still really protected uh, because most cases, if you're going to get a really protective case, like you're a really durable one, it's going to be a lot thicker than this. But that feels like really strong. So I really like that case right there. That's a nice case. So let's look at this white case next. Uh, this is for the iPhone 3GS or 3G. Uh, not my favorite case out of all of them, but definitely protective. I, I like cases that are protective. I want to use a case not because it looks good. I want to use a, a case because it's protective. And this thing is definitely, definitely protective. Uh, it's, it feels like kind of like a... I don't know what kind of material that is. It's like a... It's really durable. I know that. Uh, and it feels like if I if I dropped it on my screen or something, like it's not going to hit because it's got... I keep getting text messages. It's got a, a pretty thick thing around the screen. Like if you can see how much it comes up off the screen. It's got a lot of uh, room around that, so you're not going to drop it. If you're worried about dropping and cracking your screen, that's a good case for that. Uh, it does give you access to all the ports, the camera. Uh, so yeah, pretty nice case. Now let's look at this one uh, next. It is a leather pouch kind of case. Uh, it's got a belt clip on it. A pretty strong belt clip, actually. And it looks, it looks like a magnet right here. I actually haven't tried this case out, so this is new to me. I actually haven't tried a case like this either, so I'm going to be uh, excited to try this out. Let's see. Fits in there pretty good. Fits on it pretty nice, and there we go. I can clamp it right on my belt, or my pants. Uh, looks pretty nice. Feels like it will give me good protection. Like it's not going to get, my phone's not going to get beat up. Looks pretty nice. And I actually do have two of these, so I can uh, give both of these away. And I'm not going to use a case like this. This is for more like a, a businessman. Uh, and look, i just seen this. It comes in a different color. As you see, that's more of a, a grayish color. But these kind of cases right here are for like business people. Because you know, you'll see, the, you'll see people that have their Blackberries and iPhones and everything on the side of their pants. And they wear these kind of cases. The, uh, they wear these kind of cases and everything. And they'll just pull out their phone and do all their emails and everything like that. That's what this case reminds me of. So definitely durable, though. And it doesn't feel like this belt clip is going to let go of anything. That's a pretty strong belt clip right there.
So the next and last case uh, is this one right here. It's a basic silicone case, and this is for the iPhone first generation. Uh, you guys know what silicone cases are. This one feels pretty nice. Uh, it does It's really grippy like most silicone cases are. Um, they actually sent me two of these. One comes in white and another one in pink. I will be giving both of these away. Uh, but as I said, this is for the iPhone first generation. So good first generation iPhone case right here. Gives you access to all the ports and buttons and... Uh, silent buttons and everything like that pretty nice all right let's get the rest of this stuff out of the way and take a minute to look at one of these screen protectors uh, let's get one for the iphone uh, 3gs or 3g i'm going to slide the rest of those to the side let's open this up i do need me a new screen protector hopefully these will be nice let's open this up I, i'm terrible at putting on screen protectors so hopefully i won't mess up i'm, I'm terrible at uh at these tedious kind of things so let's Take a peek at this. Got the screen protector itself. Uh, looks like a cleaning cloth. So these do actually come with two different screen protectors. So that's pretty cool. So let's go ahead and take one of these out. Make sure I'm doing this right again. So basically it's telling us we've got to pull this tab off. And this is the silicone side. Or at least what that's what they refer to it as. Uh, this is the cleaning cloth. I'll give my phone a wipe down really quickly. Hopefully I don't mess up on this. I really don't want to. I'm, as I said, I'm not good at this kind of tedious stuff. So let's put this on here see how easy this is. And I've got a crack in my screen up here in the top. So. Alright, looks like I did it on pretty good. So there you go. See, it's filling itself out. Wow, it actually feels pretty good. I put it on sideways, as you see. <laughs> I'm not going to redo that. But you can just take the uh, cleaning cloth and rub these bubbles out. Uh, they should come out pretty easy. Yeah, so there goes that one. So it looks pretty nice. It's a good screen protector, definitely. And it is anti-glare, so let's see if we can get some anti-glare on it. It doesn't look too bad when we have uh, light shining on it, so let's see. Yeah, that is pretty anti-glare because normally, right... If I'm looking at my iPhone right now uh, with my lights behind me and I've got my iPhone lit up, I can't really see that stuff good. So that definitely is helping with the uh, anti-glare issue. So great, great screen protector. So that is about it, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this. So thank you guys for sending me this stuff. I very much appreciate it. Check out the site if you enjoyed any of these products. If you like any of these, pick any of these up. And uh, for you guys that want to try to enter the giveaway to win some of these fantastic products, uh, follow the information in the description. I will have uh, everything that you need to do over there. Basically, all you're going to have to do, uh, go over to your Twitter account. If you don't have one, create one. Uh, you need to follow me on Twitter. I'll have links over there in the description. And uh, what you need to do is uh, tweet a certain uh, post that I will give you in the description and uh, then I will randomly select a winner probably a week or two weeks from now uh, and pick the winners of all these cases and screen protectors and stuff like that. I like to do these kind of videos for my subscribers and stuff and every time a company asks me uh, if they would like to or if I would like to review one of their products I always 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 tell them to send me extra uh, to give away to you guys because I know you guys like these giveaways and stuff and I try to do as many of them as possible so uh, hopefully I've got a lot more giveaways and stuff coming up in the future uh, I'm going to go ahead get some of these uh, bubbles out and center this thing up and I'll see you guys in the next video thanks for watching peace out